Hey buds, welcome back to Madibles and welcome back to our JoJo Bizarre Adventure. As always, I hope everybody here on Patreon and on YouTube is enjoying the series, uh, however it is being produced, whether it's uncut or cut, whichever you prefer or what you like, I hope you guys are enjoying it regardless. Just a reminder that I put everything on Patreon um, completely uncut, just so you guys can watch um, the entire thing without any kind of bleeps, blurs, blops, bloops, and derps. I'm not super far off being able to do this as a career, and that would be absolutely delightful, so I don't have to be stressed out about uh, constantly looking for a job. I apply to stuff like almost weekly at this point. I just have a very weird resume that can only be applied to a few certain positions in my in my career field, of course. So again, there's no pressure whatsoever. I hope just everybody enjoys the content. But if you um, if you if you want to support in your own way, just like the video, just subscribe, like, comment. That's 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 all I really need at the end of the day. Is just to know that uh, the YouTube is putting the content out there, and it's like, hey, people, people like this content. Why don't you check it out? And then we can find more people that end up liking the content, and then. And then that's how I can it can work for me too. Thank you for being here. Thank you for supporting and watching the series. I greatly appreciate it. Let's get into it. Hi, how's it going? Check out this thing. Greatly appreciate it. Welcome to the series. Alright, let's do it. Kids are more in okay. Oh. So you're a kakyoi. Ma shikara. Kids are リオのいる街路まであと800キロ足らせ。みんな用心して旅を続けてくれ。I—that's rough. I don't know. Do we leave somebody with him? Is—is that like a safe option? You know? I don't know. Like, we've seen how much trouble they can be when you just like are alone, let alone if you're alone and blind. You know? Like they're gonna get attacked. I don't even want to know the conversion rate. なんだろうこの <laughs> That would drive me insane. Oh, hi, YouTube. How's it going? I'm really interested to see how the villains are going to be after season two, part three, and uh, how it's going to be. Because it's interesting because it's always pretty much revolved around Dio to some capacity, right? The first season, the first part was Dio, and then it was kind of the mask, right? Uh, the second part, second season part one, part two, is um, the, the um, was it the Aztec men, right? I can't remember their names right now. Uh, probably on my third or fourth rewatch, I'll start remembering some names. But then it was them, but they're also Dio adjacent because it was based off the mask, right? Um, and then part three is just Dio again. So after this, like, we, we gotta take Dio out once and for all, so Dio can't exist anymore, right? The fuck? Is it, that doesn't look like a katana, does it? I mean, I guess the shape of the sword definitely is, but I've never seen a katana with that kind of hilt before. I love this guy's, like, face shape. Like, it's, it's almost like a perfect egg shape. It kind of reminds me of the guy from, uh, you guys remember 300? He got the crazy piercings and, uh, he had the whole, like, spear, like, almost hit his face. Got crazy. Immediately, I'm thinking of a, like, um, a sword in the stone kind of thing. I forgot King Arthur, right? Um, which I guess is going to be the nice guy over on the right. He's going to be like, oh, you mean this? And then maybe the spirit 
uh, I'm assuming of Anubis, since that's what the episode's named after, will inherit this dude. Will maybe inherit isn't the proper word. Will absorb into this guy, and this guy's gonna be like, hey, ba 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 Jesus. I know not a lot has happened yet. But this is sick. I don't I don't know why I like this one so much. The just the idea of like a artifact. I mean this could also be the stand or uh Anubis. I don't are, are they technically stands if they're like the gods, you know? I'm kind of curious on how that works. Uh, I'll just call them stands for now, just to keep it simple. So I wonder if this is just like a stand object, or if this is just like the god choosing somebody, you know? Father? And his father's a piece of shit? I mean, probably. But what happened here? Is this a color inversion or did you just like something? <laughs> This is sick. This is very cool. Like, this feels a little different from what we've been doing. Even the animation, like something about it, just I don't know if it's a, like like the, physically how it looks, but something is different. <laughs> If Iggy catches him eating this fucking gum, it's gonna go fucking nuts. Where did the idea come from for like coffee flavored gum? Not like in, uh, just in the show. It's like the most random thing I could have thought of. Oh no. Does he not notice him? Oi. Oi. ずいぶん肝っ玉がでかいじゃねえか。こんな人の多いところで攻撃仕掛けてこようなんてよ。男らしいぜ。イネと思っていたぜ。名乗りな。ナワチャカ。名界の神アヌビスを暗示とするスタ
and he's always kind of getting beat up and i like him a lot too and i know he's like a competent fighter but this seems like this might be a little much Tell you. fuck him up come on i'm rooting for you still スタンドでなくその剣で俺と戦うというのか。スミの悲しい剣の握り方や構えの姿勢、どうしろとだぜ。しかし何かおかしい、何かやばいぞ。一歩前を広げた方がいい。Damn。So he gets sliced through things, dude. I don't know, man. Just bring in Jotaro and just call it a day. Just, I was gonna say Purple Hermit. Just, uh, Star Platinum. Purple. Damn it. Something Platinum, right? Bring him in. Hey! I like that this is included now. I feel like. Actually, durability in A. Huh, growth potential C. We have not seen a single growth potential thing occur yet. Alright. Um, durability, I don't know. Is it just because the sword is indestructible? Uh, precision E. Like, okay, I guess. Again, I know that these don't technically make sense, but the fact that they're still here, I want I still want to evaluate based off of the stats. Power B, sure. Speed B, I think it's based off the user maybe. Uh, which a B might be a little high for like a regular person, you know. So I think speed speed should be a C. Power should be, I think B is fine for power. Range sure, it's melee range, and you can't be far from the user. So they have to D de disarm him. They gotta disarm him. Precision, I don't know. That's not not appliable. <laughs> That's a B speed? That's an A speed. Now that I think about it, with the intro, was there three people on the stairs or four people on the stairs? Kakuin, Jean Pierre, Jojo, Jojo 2. And then uh, Paula, so there's five. But I don't remember there being five people in the intro, like climbing up the stairs. Do we lose someone on the way? Because this is getting a little scary. <laughs> Why is that we have to have a weird laugh? Oh my God. Power B. Did you guys fucking see that shot? That was the coolest thing he's ever goddamn done. Nails him. Look at this. Look how sick this shot is. Honestly, great job. Jotaro ni mo himitsu no chariots no oku no te da ze. Kono kenshin wo tobasu no wa na. Motto mo ippon shika nae kara kawasare tara ken ga naku naru nde. There we go. Oh no. Okashi na. Oh no. Oh ken. Saya ni osamatte ruzo. Oh no. I didn't even think about this being an option. そこにいたのか。一人でいなくなるから心配したぞ。This is a Lord of the Rings thing, isn't it? It's like, my precious.
And then he's going to cut, he's going to take it out. He's, I think I already have a solution. We'll go back to the classic. What you do is you find a nice, beautiful chest. And you put that sword inside the chest. Throw a lock on that. Maybe two, two more locks. Three locks total. Maybe some duct tape. Send it to the moon. Not even to the moon. Just the outer space. Send it with the other guy. Make them float and turn it together. And then boom. No more sword problems. Kurogemata あの別心の暗示のスタンド使いと言ってたぜ。うん。剣の達人で物を切断できるスタンド使いだった。あつは襲ってき。あれ。ない。ネズミだ。ネズミが剣を持って行こうとしてるぞ。こら。まったく気色